In a powerful display of protest, Borussia Dortmund fans made their voices heard during Tuesday's Champions League match against Newcastle United. As Niklas Volkrug scored the opening goal for Dortmund, supporters in the famous Yellow Wall stand took the opportunity to express their dissatisfaction with the upcoming competition reforms. The game was briefly interrupted as fans threw fake money, gold bars, and even tennis balls onto the pitch. Players joined in the efforts to clear the debris, causing a delay in the restart of the match. Alongside this act, a banner was unfurled, boldly stating, you don't care about the sport, all you care about is money. Above the banner, drawings depicting FIFA president Johnny Infantino, PSG president Nasser al Khalafi, and former Juventus chairman Andrea Agnelli were displayed, highlighting their involvement in the reforms. But this wasn't the only message Dortmund fans wanted to convey. Another banner promoting the website Reclaim the Game was displayed, directing attention to a blog that criticizes the upcoming Champions League reform. The blog emphasizes the negative impact on players, fans, and national competitions, stating, football for millions of fans, not for billions of euros. These protests come as the 2023-24 season marks the final year of the Champions League in its current format. From the 2024-25 season, the group stage will be replaced by an expanded league phase known as the Swiss model. This change will increase the number of matches from 125 to 189, providing more opportunities for revenue but potentially at the expense of the fans and the essence of the sport. It's not the first time Dortmund supporters have used their platform to make a statement. During last year's Champions League group stages, they protested against the staging of the World Cup in Qatar, displaying a banner that read, Boycott Qatar 2022. Despite the protests, Dortmund emerged victorious with a 2-0 win over Newcastle, securing their position at the top of Group F. These passionate fans have shown that they are not afraid to voice their concerns and fight for the integrity of the game. As the new Champions League format comes into effect, it remains to be seen how these changes will truly impact the sport. Will the focus on money overshadow the love and passion of the fans? Only time will tell. What are your thoughts on these protests? Do you support the fans' actions or do you think they should leave the decision-making to the authorities? Let us know in the comments below. And don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more football news and updates. Thanks for watching.